What's up? You two man, you know what I'm saying? It's your boy Jahi back with another video today. Odell Beckham Jr., the long, long, extremely long-term free agent, has signed with the Baltimore Ravens. Let's go. As some of y'all may know, you know what I'm saying? If we real life friends, so you actually watch the videos consistently, and if you do, you use a real one. Go ahead. Press that subscribe button. It's somewhere down there. But if you do know, I've been a long time fan of Odell Beckham. One of the main reasons I really love the game of football. He really brought that excitement that I did not know was there. Because I just, for a while, I just said I like the Giants without knowing why. You know what I'm saying? They had won a Super Bowl. We had uh, some good players. But then Odell came along and uh, revitalized that energy deep, deep inside me. I stopped playing football for a long time. Not playing. Played one time. Stopped watching football for a minute really paying attention because my brother used to beat me in Madden all the time he would use the Ravens and I ended up knowing like the entire Ravens roster and I would get demolished pummeled it was bad but you know look look it all came pro circle one of my favorite players my favorite receiver in the game has now joined my brother's favorite team now I just hope this means I hope this translates into maybe Lamar stand who knows he's supposed to be a free agent right now they told him he can look around Hopefully this signing was either to make him want to stay because they finally got him some assistance. What he needs is an old line, but somebody to throw the ball to is also immaculate, and we need that, or they need that. I'm going to announce this now. I'm now a partial Ravens fan. I supported Lamar Jackson and the Ravens before, but now I really got no other option but to be a partial Ravens fan. That's got to be my number two team. Am I wrong for that? Absolutely not. But if you if you say you like the Ravens, I'm sorry, but you just have not been a long-term Odell Beckham fan like I have, you know. I've been him, I've been with him since day one, since rookie year. LSU, I was not watching college football at the age of 12. I was not that deep in. But look, I'm happy to see what's going on. I really am. Got the draft coming up. The Ravens might get them some more picks. They really, they really might be all in. Hey, Lamar, look, we're going to be open. We're going to let you look around. We're going to make this a pretty place and make you want to stay. Maybe that's their plan. Maybe they want to give him ultimate control, but still sell him to stay. Now, that would be a smart move. Kind of. Maybe. I don't know, actually. Maybe it's trying to sell them, like, hey, look, you can go. But we're going to make this a nice place for you to stay, but you can go. But whoever comes in here, they're going to they gonna get it. They're going to get Odell and all these upgrades we've got to get. Maybe that's how the Ravens decided they want to move as soon as t his, his career comes questionable with the Ravens. It's real odd to me. Actually, it's really odd, Ravens. Handle your business. But hey, we are happy to see Odell Beckham finally on the team. I would have been happy to see him back on the Giants because we all know we could have used some people with hands. Because Daniel Jones was not looking too happy with nobody to throw the ball to. Obviously, he never complained. So we loved Danny Dimes. But we just all knew. Without, um, Darius Slayton stepped up. I like Darius Slayton. But, um, Sterling Shepard out. Kenny Galladay being terrible. Kadarius Tony being like I don't even know what to call him. He was really an Anthony Davis on the football field, you know. So it's just it's just what it is. But we still had a great season. Now the Ravens got what they needed, some of what they needed. Now the Giants got to get what they needed. And I'm a happy football fan. You will never hear me talk again. There's gonna be more videos talking about how immaculate the New York Giants are gonna be this year. But right now we're talking about Baltimore. We got a product of the, of the big blue New York Giants system. And a champion, we gotta remember that. And a champion, the the man with the greatest catch in football history, is now headed to the Baltimore Ravens with one of the best quarterbacks in the NFL, top five quarterbacks in the NFL. I hope y'all ready for this season because I am. This should be great. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Give some video ideas down below. I hope y'all enjoy my retwist. And I'm out. Hey, hey, I know y'all see this, man. So go ahead, like, press that subscribe button, press that notification bell, and make sure you come back for another video.